My fourth guest does have an introduction video. Uh, I think they have an introduction video? Uh, yeah, they do, they do. Yeah, I'm correct. So we're going to fight over to the screen and we'll see you in a second. <laughs> Let's go frame by frame. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> I can't wait for the I wanted to see the jump scare. <laughs> What's going on with my I thought they said Una Solis, I got excited, but okay. <laughs> Fucking excuse me. <laughs> you absolute fucking bitch. That was an amazing one. <laughs> that was so good. <laughs> oh, no. So, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen. Please welcome my fourth guest to the stage. <laughs> it is Austin X Gaming. <laughs> that fucking video. <laughs> welcome, welcome. Thanks for coming on the show. It's lovely to meet you. <laughs> hello, hello. I, I had no idea you had full body. Wow. I, huh. I, I had no idea. Huh. huh, like all of the clips and things that I've seen of you have always been like VTuber stuff. So I had no idea you had like full body VR as well. So big clouds, big clouds. That's nice. Big clouds. Yeah, big clouds. Um, so welcome to the show. Thank you so much for being here. Um, tell us a little bit more about you, Bean. Tell us um, who you are and what you do. Mm -hmm. I am a YouTuber that does variety content, but mostly I've been doing more horror than usual. I kind of got that vibe. For yeah. Almost 10 years now. <laughs> yeah, we were going to touch on that actually. That's insane. And obviously, there's been some changes in that time, and we will talk about those. Yeah, um, y y th th thank you so much for the intro video, by the way. Really appreciate you putting that together. So, um, okay, that, that noise you make, that, ooh. <laughs> ooh. Is that kind of like, is that like a signature thing for your channel? Is that like kind of like a catchphrase or, or something you use quite a lot? Pretty much. I just make weird noises to exciting stuff. <laughs> I'm glad I don't make weird noises or anything like that. It's totally, yeah, yeah. I, I don't know. I don't know what that's like. <laughs> <laughs> but, <laughs> thank you so much for coming on the show it's lovely it's lovely to see you um it's been uh once again i i'm pretty sure i've known you from b before like before times like a long time ago like we're not strangers to each other are we hmm. we are mm -hmm. i could have sworn i've met you before i don't know I, I, but I know of you. Like we've spoken on, we've spoken on Discord before. I'm pretty sure. Like you're, you're definitely not a stranger. Like I know you. So, hmm. please notice me. No, notice me, senpai. <laughs> <That's>... <laughs> um. So, <laughs> there was um a couple of things that you um mentioned to me, and one of them you've already said already. So. You are predominantly a YouTuber. You don't use Twitch, I believe. Is that correct? Am I am I right in saying that? From time to time, I do. Okay. It's just that I don't live alone, and there's noises a lot out there, a lot. A lot of background so interference. Yeah. yeah. Uh, did you find that that has impacted like your YouTube recordings as well? Do you have to re-record things because of like external noises and things, or? Not really. I have an audio program to reduce background noise. Oh, okay. I know what you mean. Yeah, hold on. I'm just turning the world yeah. down. I want to make your voice a little bit higher. There we go. Um, yeah, I, I should, I should uh, like, when I move into my new yeah. apartment, apparently planes might be an issue. So I might have to, might have to start doing that. But couldn't you do that and then come back to Twitch? Or do you live stream on YouTube? Have you ever live streamed on YouTube? 
years ago, yeah, but not anymore. Mm -mm. What 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 made you make the 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 the, the jump from? Because looking at your Twitch account, it's like two years, three years, I think, since any content was on there. Like, and then you jumped over to full time YouTube instead. Um, what, you mentioned obviously the background noise, but if you could eliminate it, would you go back to Twitch or would you stay where you are? Are you happy? Honestly, I like where I am, but I do want to stream more often. It's just that noise is just. <laughs> yeah. Load, okay. So give, give, give. Sits. Yeah. Give us an idea of your like your situation. You live with family, I'm guessing. Or... Yes. Okay. And I can imagine family life noise. You know the general things. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm oh my god. Okay. I used to get this. Like, do you, do you ever like the problem with streaming at home when you live with family is that you can't explain to family what it is you do because it doesn't they they don't really care. <laughs> As far as they're concerned, you're just playing games or something. And then you'll be yeah. in the middle of a stream and they'll be like, uh, can you come and help me with this? And you're like, but, but, I'm, but I'm live. Um, <laughs> is that the sort of thing that you would have to face by being, al uh, uh, being alive? Yeah. Yeah, see, I, 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 can, I, I know the pain. When I lived at home with my family, there was no way I was going to be streaming. <laughs> like... <laughs> there would be too many interruptions, even though, you'd, like, I had my own room, but no. <laughs> I can imagine a lot of people at home have that trouble as well. Mm -mm -mm. Um, also, someone in the chat says, uh, Animator says, love you, Austin. It looks like some of your community have come out today to see you. Oh, that's Cute. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mm -mm -mm. I really like it when um, streamers communities come out to support them uh, when they're on the stream. And also, also, if you have any embarrassing stories you want to tell me about Austin for the show, let me know. <laughs> I, there's going to be a few. There must be. Um, <laughs> so, um, you, going back to YouTube, so you are um, uh, solely a YouTuber for the, for, the, for for now, and you have been long term. I believe your ten year anniversary is coming up soon. Is that is that correct? Yes. Uh, it's on the. I'm making a is huge it? project for it. Oh, is it you doing something for? It? <laughs> Tell us what. Yeah, Tell pretty us what. much a mantra of all the videos I made in the past 10 years I had to go through six days worth of videos oh, wow and my <laughs> your, video editor your does not eye. like it your video editor is probably screaming <laughs> yes it takes like five minutes to load it with that that's oh yeah no you're on your own with that one um i you you also regarding editing this is a personal question like uh, that can help me and obviously other potential streamers or people who are making content at the moment because you've done youtube for so long i can imagine you've dealt with quite a lot of different video editing software and programs and third party applications what have you found to be the, the the easiest or the best to use for your kind of content as a VTuber? Have you found like it's Filmora, Vegas Pro, any of the free ones? What what do you use? The one I use is Vegas Pro. Ah, oh, Vegas Pro. See, now, I've heard that Vegas Pro, are like, I, I have an old version of Vegas Pro that I use for some simple stuff I do. For example, the intro video, like, that I do at the start of every show. Um, but I've heard that it has issues where it crashes a lot or it's very unstable. Have you encountered those problems or is it generally quite good for you? A lot. <laughs> I press control S like every 30 seconds. That's insane. Okay, which version of P P Vegas do you use? Is it an older one or a newer, newer version? Currently a newer one. I use 14, so I'm, I'm a little bit out of date, but I haven't had these crashing issues. I have never crashed using Vegas Pro, but I think it's because I do simple, small-scale stuff on an old version. I think that's the only reason I get away with that. Yeah, when it's more bigger, the more often it'll crash. Yeah, see, I've never dealt with any big projects, so I, I've never had to worry about that. But, you know, it's expensive. It's like, how much How much does it cost? Like $600 or something? You would expect it to run. <laughs> Yeah. Hmm. Have you have you tried any other video editing software? Have you always been a, a Vegas boy? Vegas boy. See, I've I'm... tried others, mm. but I'm more used to Vegas Pro style. 
Yeah, it's got it's every every one of them works in a different way, and it's really really annoying having to learn a new one because it's like, well, why can't I just do it like that, like I did in that program? <laughs> it can be very frustrating. Um, I I've currently tried a few programs. I tried some free ones. I really like Filmora right now. I I, I feel like I'm kind of leaning towards that because it's good for like shorts and TikToks and things. So. And my content is always short. Your your content is generally a lot longer. Like, how, how long is your average video? It's, yeah. <laughs> how many hours is From your average? 10 minutes to half an hour. Yeah, I was going to say, I you have more than an hour. I've seen, so, you also have some videos that did quite well. They had like 8,000 views, seven 8,000 views. And they were quite right. long videos. So, mm -mm. have you, have you, uh, there's, there's many questions I want to ask you. <laughs> Because we we've never had like a dedicated YouTuber on the on the show before, so this is like ah questions, yeah. <laughs> um, uh, you, oh, animator says they love your editing. By the way, he's edited many of your you edited other people's compilation videos. Is that correct? I have. Yes. I, knew, I had no idea you did. Like, is that commission based or is that just something you do for friends? I did that for my friend. Because they lost a video editor due to school, so oh. mm. I decided to take over for a while. Aww, that's very kind of you. Aww, see, that's what friends are for. Aww, that's so sweet. Um, and regarding sort of your ten years on YouTube, you have rebranded sort of. You you started a new channel sort of two years ago, I think. Am I right there? Almost. Yeah. About two and a half years ago, okay, not I started too far. a new one. Yeah. What made you start again, so to speak? What made you make a, a change to a new brand? Because it was slowly going downhill and the video content wasn't necessarily the greatest. Mm -hmm. Just very cringe, 14, 15 year old <laughs> self me is just cringe. <laughs> so I went and decided to create a new channel with my own all content. And have you found that that was a good decision or was it a bad decision? Have you seen more success since doing it? Not yet, but I feel like over time it will because I feel happy about the decision. Yeah, ultimately it's about taking your content in the direction that you enjoy. Um, obviously it's great to please the masses, but if you don't enjoy it, then, you know, it, it becomes a chore, doesn't it? So, no, you've got to stick to your guns. And um, I hope that your channel continues to, to, to grow. Um, I, wah, 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 wah. There's so many things here. It's ridiculous. Like, the, I, I write down a list of things for every guest and yours is just like... <laughs> um, so, um, outside of um, uh, YouTube... Do you do any other forms of content creation? I believe you do music, which we haven't touched on yet. Oh, yeah. Yeah, tell us more about the music side and, and what, what kind of music you make and what you do. I started back in 2013. Wow. I do it less than the past, but I do it with more love to put into it because I learned more from it. Mm. And I generally enjoy it. I make it in FL Studio. There, there is another one of those things where there's like a million programs you can use. I know a lot of people, and it can be sometimes Mimi, use Fruit Loops. I, I don't really know these programs, but I have heard of many of them. Um, regarding sort of your, your music and your creation, do you take inspiration from a, a specific artist or band or genre? Um, and does that kind of sway the kind of music that you make? Hmm. I haven't really thought about it. But I think I have, but they don't make music anymore, so I forgot the name. <laughs> Wait. So there, there was a, a band that you, you, you kind of did, did. Okay, did someone get you into music? Like, was it a band that originally got you into it, or? No, it's just one person. Oh really? Who was it? Who was it? <laughs> I, I can't remember. <laughs> <laughs> Were they like a friend or was it just a band or something? Just a random person that made music on YouTube. Mm, I, you remind me of like a really obscure name. No one in the world would have ever heard of this and it sounds ridiculous. Banana Pie Lord. 
great music made it about 10 years ago they haven't made anything since but actually really really nice and it's so obscure no one knows of it so i kind of get the idea of the vibe of what you mean and the fact that i remember that name boggles my mind i don't know why i remember this yeah go check them out <laughs> so um how many songs have you produced and and put out so far in your in your career would you say six zero zero that's insane. that's a lot that's a, that's a lot of songs and um how how successful has the music been like um do you know how much how many views your most successful video has like music video that's music Almost yeah 200,000 holy huh channel what okay this shows the small content. <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> totally small content. Totally, but it was during FNAF phase, the huge FNAF. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay, there were a couple of things a year, but a couple of years ago, where if you jumped on that train, you were going to find success. Five Nights at Freddy's, Undertale, um, Homestuck. You know, if you got into any of these, it was just views. <laughs> so uh, you, you would you say you make a lot of computer game inspired music so you make like that you mentioned five nights at freddy's for example or do you just kind of just make off the wall your own sort of stuff sometimes it's my own type of music i think of and sometimes it's remixes of other songs That's oh you do remixes music. as well i i have to say i will be guilty here i haven't listened to your music yet i have seen your youtube though um, and it's obviously below, guys. Go and listen to the music. I will. Hey, wait, uh, oh, okay. I've killed my cat. <laughs> Please don't die yet. We need you. <laughs> um, is there any songs that you specifically suggest I listen to as a new listener to your to your content? The newest one I made. I made one from Super Smash Brothers Melee. Oh hell yeah! I'm down. I'll de I'll definitely listen to that. One. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I, I definitely want to hear that. That would be awesome. Um, <laughs> uh, regarding the sort of your your living situation, so you're you're in a very lucky position where you're you're quite young, aren't you? Um, you're definitely younger than me, <laughs> that's for sure. Um, in in the future, sort of long term career wise, you're already ten years in, which is crazy. Would would you want to be like a full time music producer, or would you prefer to be a streamer who does games? Or would you prefer to be like, I don't know, Jack Septicai who does like pre-recorded, edited videos? Like, where would you want to focus your success if you could choose? On video editing. Video oh, just videos. in general. So, well, like, would you would you love to edit for like big name YouTubers and things? Is that sort of your dream job? Oh, that's amazing. Totally not the answer I expected, if I'm honest. So that's really interesting. And... You've been working with these these programs for so many years that you must know kind of a couple of tricks that, that are off the beaten path, so to speak. Um, what would you say yeah. the longest project took you to do? The one I'm making right now is. Yeah, the, it sounds like it's a mammoth task. Where, how long have you been working on it? Two weeks now. I'm only a little bit done two weeks and you're what what, what did you say you're the 10 percent <laughs> it's gonna be a hell of a project that's 20%. insane okay so a little bit more oh is that is that like i i feel like you you know that game 21 questions where you're just like question 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 i i feel <laughs> i'm just rallying into you with questions i feel really bad <laughs> but this is like this is like a rare opportunity for me where we we get someone on who is you know um i i i love everyone i have on the show but it's nice to have someone who does something a little bit differently you know so um uh doing youtube predominantly instead of twitch and also doing music and you know editing and things so yeah this is this is quite interesting for me and you, you can tell when i'm like i'm just like ah. <laughs> <laughs> just, <laughs> would you would you um uh, consider live streaming on youtube if you know you moved out and there was no noise issues would you take the stream in that direction or is that something that you just don't think you'd enjoy i feel like i might but i prefer video editing more i don't have no idea why but i 
just do like the guts say i prefer this hmm i'm really interested now like in in the video editing stuff because i'm learning a lot myself at the moment because i've gone full time with with like content creation and stuff um i've i've had to learn like video editing and programs and stuff and it's it's quite hard it's not easy but there's a lot of tutorials out there that help a lot um but i don't think i'll ever get to obviously your sort of <laughs> what takes me like an hour you probably do in two minutes <laughs> probably <laughs> mm -mm. and um you, at the moment you you said that you do like iol streams as well in your content as well as like wait hold on was that was that no that was clutch i think clutch does I, iol stuff i don't I show my face <laughs> no you're fine <laughs> Would you ever, like, would you consider yourself a VTuber who wants to never do, like, face reveals and things? Or is it something you would potentially do in the future? I've done the face webcam stuff in the past, mm -hmm. but... I but don't you kind of moved away from that it. Anymore. Yeah, that's it. You need to be comfortable with it. And, um, you know, I, I, I love that VTubing gives people the ability to do something that they otherwise may not have been able to do. So, that's really nice. Huh. I'm just looking at the time. This I I I have asked you so many questions. <laughs> uh, I I feel like you know when you go to an interview for a job and they're like they they just ask you. I feel like I've uh, uh, yeah hi. <laughs> yep. Um, just in a more casual sense. Um, obviously you've got full body tracking for VR. Do you play a lot of VR chat? Is is do you have lots of friends in the, in the game? I have a lot of friends. Yeah. I, like I'm surprised we've never run into each I other. Hmm. I played it less than I used to, but I still play a good amount of it. Yeah, I've noticed that quite a lot actually. Um, the the VR chat scene is always evolving and changing because people are, you know, they're really heavy, heavily intensive when they first get into it, and then as the years go on, they sort of um, uh, start playing a little bit less, and then new people come in, and you know, the 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 everything sort of changes slowly over time. Cycle. Yeah, it's like the great, the the great circle of life. <laughs> it's kind of like that. <laughs> mm, but like I said, I'm surprised. Like, oh, oh, that I found my cup. <laughs> You've been playing for so long, we've never run into each other, which is crazy. I could have sworn I know you. Like, I I just know this name. I don't know why. It's it's really weird. <laughs> Okay, we're gonna fly over to chat because we're quickly running out, running out of time. Midnight, be ready for your segment, Beam, because we'll be with you soon. Um, but before before we um uh, before we disappear, I want to do a, a couple of questions. We're pretty much doing okay for time. Like I've had to be so careful to keep today's show on stream uh, on schedule. Usually, what we do is we run for like an hour over over time <laughs> because I just can talk to people forever. But today, my last guest sadly has to be somewhere precisely at the end of the show <laughs> so i can't overrun which is like we so i'm doing my best to actually be on the schedule which is just alien for me i never do this so. wow, but i'm schedule yeah i know i on schedule like this is the seventh episode the eighth if you include my pilot episode and this is the first one that so far is on time <laughs> like, <laughs> miracles do happen guys <laughs> they do happen so, but um, I, I want to fly over to chat. Chat, so do you have weird. any questions that you wanted to ask Austin at X Gaming? Uh, can you see chat as well? Have you got the chat window up on your side? You do? Yeah. Oh, you got it just there. Okay, yeah. So feel free if you spot any questions or anyone you want to talk to and reply to, feel free. Like, you're more than welcome. This has been really nice. <laughs> Oni, hi, Oni. Oni, we're on time so far. Yay. <laughs> Oni's my final guest. <laughs> Uh, Cisco says level or latex. <laughs> Real wholesome, C Cisco. <laughs> what, what would you prefer, level or latex? Cisco. Okay, Cisco put lever or latex. There, there's no other context. It's just <laughs> latex. Agreed. <laughs> yeah. We're on the same page. <laughs> mm -mm -mm -mm. Um, my friend uh, asks who is my favorite YouTuber. Yeah, that's a and good I'll one. I'll say Markiplier. Markiplier. See, I'm not a huge fan of Markiplier. This is just obviously a unpopular opinion right here. I think he's overly loud and annoying. 
I said it. Yeah, I I'm, like overly loud yeah, and annoying. <laughs> And we, why have we not met? Because I am loud and annoying. <laughs> like, <laughs> hmm. So, um, is there anyone else that you take inspiration from as well as Markiplier? An old friend of mine, Master Max Eight Eight Eight. He was the one that helped me want to do more YouTube when I wasn't feeling up to it uh -huh. in the heart and I decided to he go kept you on it. the path oh that's so nice it's lovely that friends can give each other the support they need at, at, the, at the times that we need it <laughs> yes. okay, did you spot any questions as well Bean <laughs> 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 Oh, no. <laughs> I'm just thinking of your intro video now. You're just like, ooh. <laughs> <laughs> What's this all about on dagger rolls and shocks? Welcome, welcome. It's lovely to see you. Mm -mm -mm. Chelsea, you like Markiplier as well? You think they're all right? Yeah. Uh, it's, uh, I have an unpopular opinion there. I just, I'm not a huge fan. So it's just kind of on me, if I'm honest. Mm -mm. Oh, Animator's got one for you. It's just come on. It's just come up. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What is the current games I am playing? Mm, that's a good question, actually. I, ne I never asked about what you're currently playing. Uh, you mentioned you're doing a lot of horror recently, but um, is, is there anything coming up that you're doing in the future that you haven't started playing yet? Mm, there is a couple horror games I just find randomly on Game Jolt. Mainly .exe games. If you ever heard of .exe, then yes, those types of <laughs> .exe games. Mm -mm -mm. So There's you... a lot I'm following now. You, you, you play a, a huge mix. You play some of the A-list titles and you also play some of the more obscure stuff as well. So you kind of keep it mixed. Yes. Uh, what, what do you prefer? Is it the, the, the more obscure titles that you find the more fun? Or is it like the mainstream that really takes your fancy? The more obscure because sometimes it does something that you don't expect. Yeah, that's kind of it. Because, oops, yeah, yeah that you make a very good point. Some of the scariest like things that I've played or done have been like... You know, they're not triple A list titles. Some of them can actually be quite boring, I'll be honest. Um uh what is it called? Um Amnesia Rebirth, the new one. I, I was massively underwhelmed at that one. I thought that was not great. So in comparison to its original, I was just like, eh. Made me the big sad. Yeah, yeah, you you're in the same page as me, yeah. It wasn't great. Like this it had more story, but it had too much story. It like it kind of ruined it for me. I, I just feel. wanted to find the yellow statue, Stefano. <laughs> 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 okay, um, I think there's no more questions. I think we're okay. Okay, so we're only a couple minutes behind schedule. We're not too bad, which is fine. Um, but there is still one more thing that needs to be done before before you run away and go and continue to work on your massive project for your 10-year anniversary. Um, I'm going to throw it over to you. So if there's anything you want to mention, anything you're doing in the future, people you want to plug like hi mom um my mom's not watching but um <laughs> you know <laughs> anything like that um the floor is yours Bean. Mm -mm. well i'm gonna shout my best friends anime ar hayden dj redskin the reason why i wanted to play vr chat more and got me a new computer in vr <laughs> Just because I was their best friend. Aww. That's and it made so me want, And it made me Aww. want to do more. And I was able to. That's so sweet. Mm. Aww. I, 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 like, talking to you has been really, really chill, actually. I can imagine you're an absolute chill to hang out with. And sometimes I'm loud, but... <laughs> You have you have like two modes. You have like chill and crazy. <laughs> Just flick a switch. Chill, kind of lewd, loud. <laughs> oh, we're gonna get on really well. Kind of lewd. Yeah, that's kind of my thing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> I'm a bunny after all. What do you expect? <laughs> I can't help it. I can't help it. Mm -hmm. And I'm a dog or orc wolf. Hey, I wonder, I wonder, uh, maybe for scientific purposes, we should find out what happens if a, a bunny and a, a dog, um, 
Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, it's been my fourth guest, <laughs> Austin X Gaming. Yeah. <laughs> what a way to end. <laughs> what a way to end it. Good, great, great. <laughs> Thank you so what? much for coming on. It's been a pleasure to have you, Austin. I hope you enjoyed your time. Um, I hope you guys will go and give Austin a huge amount of... Don't you dare, Dad. I hope you'll go and give... The... Don't. No. 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 Oh, wow. You can... <laughs> I'm not sure what's worse. <laughs> Both. Ah, oh, it's been lovely to have you though. Thank you so much for coming on. Have a lovely night. <laughs> they were so nice. That was really, really good. Ladies and gentlemen, it was Austin X Gaming. Woo! Big claps, big claps. Aw, <laughs> oh, that was so sweet. That was adorable.